You're watching Greater Brockton, Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have a familiar face uh, to Brockton. I have uh, my colleague on the school committee, uh, Southeastern Bishop Tony Branch. Tony, Good to see you, Mark. See you. Thank you but, for having me. But we're, you got another hat. Yes. Okay. Yes. Um, Haitian Community Partners, which is an outstanding community organization that helps a lot of people. You're the VP? I am the Vice President. Okay. And... You are having, I think it's, is it the fourth annual gala? It is our fourth annual gala. So we're having our fourth annual gala on April uh, 8th of, of this year at 7 p.m. to 12 midnight. And we're going to have it at the Massasoit Conference Center. And I believe their address is 770 Crescent Street here in Brockton. And if you've been around Brockton a long time, you might know it as the Old Christos, too. That's correct. Okay. That's correct. Now, it's a different venue because right now the Shaw Center is in transition. Right. Okay, and it's right. been held there before. Right. But what, what can we expect that night? What's going to go on over there? Uh, HCP is an organization that helps all people. It's Correct. not just Haitians. Right. Okay. As a matter of fact, they've gone to great lengths. Marlene Amade, right. who is the president, right. has uh, said, uh, we want you to be familiar with our culture. But we're part of you. We're part of Brockton. It's one Brockton, and, and let's all get together and have a party. Right. So we. So one of the things that we've done in the, our last year and a half was we've made it, which we've tried to, in terms of of, of marketing, not only what we are giving back to the community, but also what our mission is. Our mission is a community agency, not necessarily a Haitian agency. And I think that there there's some confusion around that because we take you know all issues all issues in terms of uh, our community organizations. So uh, I'm glad that you are aware of that. But for particular to our fourth annual fundraiser, so we have Marie St. LaFleur coming, the former state representative from, uh, I believe it was the fifth district in Boston. Mm -hmm. uh, she's an attorney. She also was our former uh, chair of the Ways, vice chair of the Ways and Means Committee, a very powerful committee when she was a state representative deal, deal, dealing with the uh, state budget. So we're happy to have her as our, uh, our keynoter. So we want people to come out because it's going to be an exciting time. But one of the things that we've done, and we've done this for the last four years, is we've recognized people that have really given back to the community, the community at large. Uh, we're going to be recognizing Vincetti, uh, the supermarket, Planet Compass, the radio station, Janet Trask that everybody knows and loves, Tufts Health Plan, and as well as Signature Healthcare. So those are our honorees this year. Again, these are organizations that have been very supportive of us and have given a lot of back to the community as a whole. In terms of entertainment, we have DJ Ricky Groove, who's going to be, uh, what I, 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 you guys, I'm about to tell my age, who's going to be spinning the turntables. Um, but we also have some performers. The Student Association, Lucina's going to be there. Henry Daniel's going to be there. And the twins, the Preston sisters, are going to be there. Again, Mark, we're very excited. It sounds great. Now, question for you. I know different events in different cities. I, I tend to go for the food. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'll be there. We're going to provide some coverage of it, but you have to be there. It's, right. it's, it's not the same to watch it on TV. Right. We want to help you promote it. We want to showcase it. Correct. What's the food? Do you know? Um, I'm not sure what menu we have selected right now, okay. but I think that we're, we're, we're close to the chicken. Uh, that, that may be a rumor, uh, but you know, Massasoit, they cook the chicken very, very well. I just want to know if any of it's Haitian food. Because oh. I happen to love Haitian food. Right. I love the squash soup. Yes. Okay. Yes. The juju. I yes. Think it's called, yeah. If absolutely I'm not right. Mistaken. And uh, you know, um, I know different venues yeah. in Brockton, no. right. like places like Gino's. Right. I, I, you know, Fred Fontaine used to take me over there and say, "Well, what, <laughs> I'm not going to tell you what you're eating. Right. But you're eating something. Right. And you know, I. I, I just so, I just love it. So right, but you so with the Brockton and many people know this about our Brockton venues. Unfortunately, we're not there yet, and okay. I think hopefully we pray one day that we'll get there. That some of these events that we having, like the Haitian or even the Cape Verdean, that we'll have some of this cultural food. Unfortunately, we're not there with some of the major venues yet. But we're gonna get there. We're gonna get well, we're gonna get them some chefs. If nothing else, <laughs> back in the day there used to be a summer Sunday in the park, and we used to have food from all different cultures. That's we true. We have the Cape Verdean Festival, we have the HCP Gala, we have all sorts of things. I want them all under one roof. Right. I want an international food festival. We should I do guess. that. We okay. absolutely should do that. And uh, who knows, you know, if you look all around the country, there's food trucks. 
projects. Right. Okay. I know the city planner is working on stuff like that, but this, I mean, it sounds like a great lineup between entertainment right. Right. and honorees. Um, how would people get tickets to go? Um, there, you are welcome to go to Haitian Community Partners Foundation org. Haitian Community Partners Foundation org. You can also just Google Haitian Community Partners Brockton. You also get a link. I believe that we've successfully set up our invite so you can buy the tickets online. And we encourage people to do that. You can also feel free if you need tickets. You can also always email the bishop, bishopbranch at icloud.com. So um, again, uh, it's easy to find us on Facebook. It's easy to find us in any of the search engines. The donations, you'll see on our flyers, it says admit one. But what it really is, people, and I think people get disconnected from it, it's a fundraiser. And it really is to support our youth enrichment programs, our youth leadership programs f that happen, that are part of our student fabric here in the city of Brockton. And it's $50, people. One of the things I say that we spend, I know I use to spend Forty dollars at Starbucks, literally in a seven-day period. So this is really an opportunity for you to give back to the community. Festivities. We have our performers. We have an excellent speaker, and most importantly, you're really, really helping the young people in our community. And that young program is outstanding. We've had students scholarships from there, here that have been part of that leadership program, and it is about the next generation, right. as you and I know. Um, we. We're still there, but we right. want to bring the next generation up. Right. So, I mean, I think this is a fabulous event. I, I want people to go out and support it. There's certain staples in Brockton now every year. Like, I'm looking forward in May to the, the Haitian Flag Day. That, That's right. All the different That's right. groups. And then, like we mentioned, the Cape Verdean Front. There's so many... Nobody can say you can't do anything in Brockton. Right. The NAACP right. has stuff, and you kind of seem to be at the center of all of it. You're, I don't know where you get your time, but... Right. Um, you know, any final words? Any you want to sell it? I think we might have a minute. I need about twenty seconds of that. So uh, tell I, them. we welcome you again. It's a fifty dollar donation to Haitian Community Partners Foundation to support our youth enrichment programs. It is a uh, you're going to have a great time in terms of the entertainment. You're going to have a great time in terms of our, our keynote speaker. We are encouraging the community to come out. Re, re, you know what? We want to tell people. This is a red carpet event, but don't be disconnected by Haitian community partners. We are a community organization. We are welcoming all, and we really, really need your support. I'm sorry, I'm wrong on that. The young people need your support. Please join us. Thank you. Perfect. Good summation. I don't need to sell it anymore. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Thank you for having right us. right around the corner. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.